Hi, this is Sasha. This is your January 2018 forecast. Sagittarius. Do you remember from the year her forecast? We started on the foundation of looking at your healing and where you are with regards to healing your wounds, healing scars, traumas, traumas of the past that still affect you now, the wounds, the scars that still are contained in your body and in your energy field. This is what you have been, you came into this year with that, with that in your space around. It's so, sort of like the foundation. Now, where this January is going is uh, shown by this uh, card. Alpha Centauri, which unlimited thinking and perspective. So this means that, remember in the year forecast, we talked about the mind and how you be open to new ideas and, and stretch expanded. It started already this month. So this Alpha Centauri has to do with unlimited thinking perspective. And it's about the different potentials. You will be blessed this month with different potentials, different avenues, different directions you can go in. Several doorways will open, not just one. This is several opening for you and you will be given options you'll be shown options and it is through the way you look and where you look you'll be able to see which is which is the one that is most suitable for you at this time now so that's that's uh, exciting, but it also at the same time brings a lot of information and it might make you feel chaotic because your mind might be pulled in different directions. You would not know what to do, where to choose. It might be a bit overwhelming for you, even though it's so exciting, right? But it's now like, where do you go? What do you do with all of this? doors opening this is very positive to start a new year with the infinity symbol as well it represents that infinite possibility within you to tap into that to remember that it is within your power to choose to choose the path to choose the next step it's within your power you have the free will so this is a card to remind you of that and remind you of how many possibilities there are for you. It's a very positive uh, card. Again, also brings in some chaos. So now, how do you how do you make the most of this month? And we get Libra. This is the, the sign whose energy you can tap into more. And Libra is about being fair and balanced. So how do you, you attend to all of this crazy, chaotic information? You be fair. You wear it. You take it lightly, first of all. And... You, you weigh it on a scale. You are fair with the options. You let the divine balance, divine justice, divine order take its place in this chaos. And so this is about bringing some order uh, through, through measuring, through, through weighing your options. And in, in the light of all, all that's going to open up for you this month. Now, when it comes to aligning with your soul's purpose, your highest purpose, and tuning up your chakras, the main 
getting into which which chakra we can work a bit more. We have from the Soul Purpose Alignment cards we have Peace Keeper, and this is the Wisdom and Conflict Resolution. It talks about about how bringing again the order, bringing balance. As you can see, these two cards both have that that symbol of balance. The two birds here and the back the scale. This is this is what how will help you align this month. So this attitude here of the Libra, which is about being fair, about being just, about the balance, and this. This uh, attitude here of the peacekeeper, which is tuning into things like meditation, your crown chakra, your mind at the level of, uh, of your crown chakra. So tuning into your crown chakra again, it's, it's your mind is important, but starting from your crown, getting getting the balance that you need in your mind through things like meditation or any sort of spiritual guidance that you may need to come into balance. So this is what can help you a lot. Again, I'll just put the words there for you. And coming into balance with all the information and all the possibilities that will start to open up to you, meditation and being fair with your options, having that attitude, the lightness of Libra in dealing with some potentially serious uh, situations that could arise. Libra will be firm as well, but it's, it's a light, airy sign. Now that was your Oracle Forecast reading for January Sagittarius. If you would like a longer, more personalized reading, you can contact me book to book a session. The website is sashaniel.com. And so Sasha have a great month. Sagittarius.